Hey, beautiful people. Welcome to my channel. All right, Libra. Let's see what we got going on for you, okay? All right. This will not resonate with everyone. Take what fits and leave the rest. Oh, wow. Okay, so Libra says, if you're wondering if this will happen, the answer is yes. Although you don't see it, there's a divine plan at work. A necessary transition is happening in your life at the time. Allow it to occur. Refocus your energy to attain your goals. Try meditation to center yourself. And you are being protected by your angels. Do not worry. All right, Libra. So it looks like there's a change happening in your life. Uh, you might have got distracted a little bit. Source is telling you, you know, uh, get back on track. Kind of, you know, focus on what it is that you're doing here. What it is that you want. The goals that you want to achieve. All right. And yeah, there's obstacles here because Source has some people that you're meeting along the way. Some lessons to be learned. Some lessons to be taught here. Okay. All right. And even though you don't see it, Source is protecting you. All right. So... You may be wondering, why the heck is this happening in my life? Why is this person here and all this other stuff? And what does this mean? The source has a plan for everything, all right? Just be patient. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's see. Sometimes we'll find out what source is up to, and sometimes we don't. All right, so just roll with it. Any messages for Libra, please, and thank you. Balance, spirituality, and practicality, and it is landing over here on one card. So what is this? Major life changes. The time is right for major life changes as a new lifestyle or location brings great joy and a trouble-free existence. Absolutely. That's what I'm talking about. So some of you might actually think about moving, all right, to a better location or something like that. The energy is gaining momentum. So there's about to be a change here, okay? So kind of looks like you are... Um, Thinking about making some moves here, but it kind of looks like you're actually um, getting in tune with source here in alignment. Okay, so in other words, you might be praying, manifesting things. Um, put it like this. How can I put this? There are some dreams, goals, desires that you really want here. And you may have just been thinking about it. Now you're praying about it. So in other words, you're balancing your your practicality what you're doing in the 3d and you're you're putting it out there in the 5d and they're bringing it together okay that was really disgusting oh my god okay so i don't know if you heard that but somebody decided to come in here and share his wins with me and then he leaves wow okay so he my God, I can't make this up. Anyway, show the world the real you. Oh my God, being a pet owner is so, so beautiful. <laughs> Let's see here. <laughs> we got messages for Libra. Oh, Libra. All right, so step up and lead. What is it that you want, sweetheart? All right. Um, don't wait for somebody else to take initiative. Hell, they might be waiting for you. I don't know. This could be source waiting for you to take initiative, all right? So they uh, they can get the ball rolling. It's telling you to be humble. Take a breather. Unre unleash your kindest self. Be kind to people. Be good to people, okay? It matters. See the bigger picture, okay? So you're in a situation for a reason, May not be the reason that you think. You might be in a situation where you're kind of like, you know what? I don't know what the hell is going on. I feel like I've been sucked into a vortex of calamities. One thing after another, you know what I mean? I have a high, you know, a great high, and then all of a sudden it's a bunch of lows. And what the hell is going on here, okay? Source is actually telling you, you know, there's some things that you're going to go through right now, and I need for you to trust me, okay? Just start the start the faith walk here, Okay. Know that I'm I'm here with you. Woo sa, all right. When you're going through this transition, it might not be the easiest. And I need for you to not only remain humble, but be kind to others as well. Okay. There's a reason why you're going through this rite of passage. Who the hell is this for? I don't know why, but I just heard you're being, you're entering into a club. 
That's weird. Okay. Kind of like this is next level type ish. Okay, so some type of initiation. What the heck is this? I probably should have clarified that, but I'm going to leave it. Okay, I'm going to leave it. Hmm. Interesting. That might come back up. But anywho, give me messages for Libra, please, and thank you. Okay, so on the bottom of the deck, we have property. A property purchase sale for many, but he security concerns in any transaction, okay? So you might be thinking about purchasing a home, uh, a car, or something like that, sweetheart. is telling you, look at the fine print. Um, don't jump into something that you really don't agree with, okay? So you might be renting a place or something like that, or like I said, purchasing something, but there's stipulations here that, you know, you're kind of just wanting this because it's a good deal right now. You need it right now and you want to take it right now. But there's something here in this contract that may kind of give you a little bit, uh, I don't know, take heed to that, okay? Because it's, it's a bigger deal than you think. All right, so you have opportunities. A stranger is about to change your life. Exciting times and plenty of action, plus a special family reunion looks likely. Wisdom. To focus on the past is to lose the future. Heed advice from an older person, which will allow you to move on. Absolutely. Close the door if you need to. Reinvent yourself. A transformation is taking place. Enjoy the new lease on life. All right. So, Libra, like I said, you might be um, thinking about changing um, locations, um, possibly moving where you are from where you are, possibly taking another job or something like that. Purchasing property here. All right. Um, getting into agreements with other people here. So you need to really be careful here. There's a change that's happening in your life, okay? So you may be rebuilding your life, uh, setting the foundation here, okay? And also I see that you're using wisdom from the past, all right? All right, so it looks like you got someone here that's going to open a door of opportunity to you. So that looks pretty good. I like it. Let's see. Give me two for a leader, please, and thank you major messages manifest all right we got new beginnings happening here sweetheart all right control your emotions control your thoughts okay don't be in your head too much all right you're manifesting great things here but be careful of negative uh energy here all right be conscious of your thoughts what it is that uh you're focusing on here, okay? You got fulfillment of wishes here happening too. So Libra, it looks like you got some good stuff coming in. You just need to kind of make sure that you keep your emotions and stuff in check and don't overthink a situation, okay? Get out of your head. All right, let's see. Give me manifest. Why is manifest here for Libra? All right, you're making serious moves here, okay? Um, you may be thinking about changes when it comes to work. And things like that. You may be thinking about moving forward, like I said. There also may be some things going on with the job here that uh, you're starting to find out. Which, to me, is like if you got drama going on in the job, you got um, that boss from hell that's always on your heels and making stuff difficult, sweetheart. And you're not, you know, satisfied with working there. Um, this may be telling you that, you know, it's time to move on from something else. Or to something else, you can actually manifest something much better, okay? When it comes to your work. Let's see. Looks like you're manifesting love into your life as well, too. So this is pretty cool. Very successful here. Very successful. I like it. So whatever it is that you are calling into your life, sweetheart, it looks like it's meeting you. All right? Meeting you halfway. Do the work here. Looks like there's a lot of regret that you've had in the past here, sweetheart, that you're walking away from. Um, finally closing the door on something here, which it, your one of your cards did talk about walking away from the past. So looks like you are possibly doing that, closing the door on a situation that, you know, uh, was not prosperous here, okay? You're manifesting new beginnings here. I like it. Moving on from this with no regret. You got communication coming in here as well. 
This might be with a partnership here. All right. So you're possibly manifesting love here at this time, too. Ooh. All right. This is justice, sweetheart. All right. I see a lot of stability happening for you. Uh, a lot of changes, a lot of transformation. I see a self-love, self-care, which is really cool here, too. Possibly been a long time coming here. You may not have been, you know, loving on yourself as you should, but it looks like you're starting to do that, okay? You're also taking a break or leaving things behind that, you know, may have caused you heartbreak, pain, disappointment here, okay? Absolutely. All right? So... Whatever this is, you're moving away from this. And you got somebody that's, you know, kind of keeping an eye on you here, sweetheart. So this could be this love interest here that wants to come towards you or that is, uh, that will be speaking out to you here, all right? I also see with the Page of Swords here, in this season of your life, you've learned a great deal um, here. And you're implementing what you've learned and utilizing it for your future, okay? All right, so why is control here? Control your thoughts here. I see. Get out of your head, sweetheart. See things from a higher perspective. Absolutely. Okay. Six of coins. Um, six of coins. Six of cups. Okay. So don't, don't focus on what happened in the past. Ruminating over something here. All right. So being very nostalgic. Okay. So be careful of that, especially if it's something that could sabotage your future. Hold on. Oh, great. Oh, here it is. All right. So we have the Three of Pentacles. Oh, wow. Libra, it kind of looks like you are in your head about someone here. It looks like you do want to uh, possibly reunite with someone here with the Six of Cups or Three of Pentacles, or you want to come into agreement with someone, uh, work together, all right? But it looks like you're holding back, but secretly wanting to take this leap of faith. I don't know if you may feel that this person is wearing a false mask or, oh, If it's not you feeling like this person may have wore a false mask, uh, damn. Okay, this could be a cross watcher. Somebody may feel that Libra didn't come in with the energy that was productive for a relationship. You might feel this way too, that you didn't come in with the, the correct energy, but now you want to heal a situation after an ending. Ooh. To end up, you can, you can see that if you invest here, that this could be the Ten of Cups. Let's see. What else is this? Or somebody feels this way about you. There's love here. There's love here. But someone here may have cut this off. Now someone here is actually looking at this situation from a different perspective. Um... Ooh, they want forward movement, but it looks like this cycle may have been closed out. Somebody wants to bring this Ace of Cups with the lovers here. Four of Wands, stability. Wow. Okay, so someone is in their head about this situation because they see potential in the relationship. Libra, either this is you or this is someone else. So there may be someone on your mind right now um, that you're kind of like, you know what? I really want this to work out. Um, this could be somebody that you're dealing with already, but this could be also be someone from your past. You could have been married with this person already, all right? In a committed relationship. Hell, you could have had a whole family with this person already, all right? But feeling like, you know, I don't know if I could find my way back. It's going to take a lot of work to bring this together. I'm going to have to come in and be truthful, you understand, and, and just lay out everything on the line, straight 100 and it kind of looks like you're in your head about this situation, or this could be cross watcher, sweetheart. Somebody wants to come clean with you. There's some things that they were doing in the past that caused the demise of a relationship, and now somebody realizes that they sabotage a good connection. But what they don't realize here is that there's a divine plan here at work. So 
Source may have had to shake up your life for you to open your eyes about a connection that you've had. This could have been, you know, like I said, someone that you were with years ago. Doesn't have to be. Could be someone that is entering your life now and you're starting to see the value of that connection. I don't know here, but this is definitely coming up, you know, um, that someone is being very nostalgic right now. All right, thinking about this person from the past, wanting this to happen, wanting to take action, feeling like, you know, I could have my family, peace of mind, happiness here. This is where I want to uh, lay my head. You understand? Wow, I feel like somebody is tired, tired of the illusions, tired of, of multiple people, but not finding um, their home. You understand? Like, in other words... Um, that person that you can have peace with, okay? That person that you can relax and lay your hair down with, okay? Yeah, this person, um, there's someone that they're very passionate about, okay? Or this is you. But it looks like someone here is out in the cold. Yeah. Someone cut this off because someone was unreliable, impulsive, all over the place. You understand? In and out. Talks a good game, but it ends real quick. Let's see. Anything else about this situation? Yeah, get out your head here, sweetheart. All right, it looks like somebody here really wants to reunite. They want to take action. Somebody here wants to come in here and speak to you about this situation, clear the air. They might be in their head about this situation, or this could be you. Someone's got newfound awareness about this connection here and what it means. This is my place. This is what I'm happy. I've dealt with a lot of people here, but this brings me peace, okay? Um, yeah, this connection is, no, is, is not just um, something fly by night. This is something that keeps coming back to me. So it keeps bringing me back to this point, to this person for a reason. All right, so there's something here, Libra, that you need to figure out with this person. What is this awareness that Libra has here, please, and thank you. Hmm. Damn, that someone is, that this person is really ready to kick it up a notch. We're going from the Nine of Pentacles, Nine of Cups. To the Ten of Pentacles here. Okay, so this person's single, working. Um, there's someone here that is within reach that they want, but there's distance here because someone is not being their authentic self. Someone's hiding behind the mask, but they see their empress, and they want to take off the mask and tell this empress that they want a connection here. Mm-hmm. Somebody has gotten clarity about this empress, okay? You see this empress or this empress sees you, but somebody's in their head not making a move here. They know what they want. They're trying to weigh their options. Should I, shouldn't I, should I, shouldn't I? So I don't know, Libra, what you're going to do because it's here. It's here. Um, or a cross watcher is here. So you just need to speak up and speak your piece. All right. Be upfront and honest with this person and see what it is that, you know, that you want. And have an adult conversation about it, okay? All right, so let's see. What else we got going on for Libra? And I do apologize if you can hear the noise in the background. All right, let's see. Hmm. Watch your anger, Libra. Okay. For some of you, there could be someone leaving your life here. And it also came out with control your anger. So there might be a heated um, argument, a heated discussion with you and someone here that uh, might end up, you know, changing the dynamics of a relationship here, okay? Just make sure that you're kind of looking from that person's point of view as well, okay? Three messages for Libra, please, and thank you. All right, Libra, so when your prizes, you are on the road to success. Can I get three more, please, for Libra? 
Ooh, strong emotion, passionate or hate for someone. Passionate love or hate. Let's see. What you got going on? Dylan's a relationship with a man. So this could be a male that you are dealing with. Doesn't have to be. Just could be a masculine energy. All right. So let's see. We have the boat. Money or property through inheritance or windfall. The fire. Strong emotion. Passionate love or hate. We have the vine. Seek out information that will help you. The boot. Increase your efforts if you want to achieve your goals. Victory in some endeavors. So horseshoe. You got good luck. Uh, mountain road, you're on the road to success, tense, temporary situation. This could be a housing situation, doesn't have to be. It just could be that you're in the midst of something right now and it's only temporary. And you have the rat, someone is working against you behind your back. Wow, okay, Libra. It's the first time I've ever seen you get this one, I think. All right, so you got to be careful of who is in your circle, like I said, sweetheart. Um, it does look like there is somebody leaving your life, so it could be this person here. You might kind of find out that someone is working against you, speaking against you. You know what I'm saying? Um, yeah, possibly kind of low-key, maybe hating on you a little bit, doing a little salt on your game here. So, But Source is going to reveal this to you, whoever this is, all right? So let's see. Clarify the rat here. I'm only going to clarify the things that kind of look like it might be problematic. Because everything else looks pretty good. All right. Let's see. Clarify the rat here. Why is this person here? All right. Death. All right, Libra. There may be something that you're trying to achieve here. And um, it might be someone that is actually trying to block or hinder you here. All right, and this is telling you with the boot, increase your efforts if you want to achieve your goals. And this actually landed over here too. So I don't know if there is, hell, not being funny, there could be something that you're trying to achieve, but someone is trying to stop it here, okay? There could also be someone that, you know, you're in a connection with and you're really trying to um, get out of this situation. However, someone may be prolonging it, whatever. All right, I don't know. But whatever this is, source is telling you to increase your efforts. Somebody's trying to work against you. Or either there's some type of changed uh, growth or transformation that you're wanting to take place. But someone here may be blocking it, okay? All right, this could be on a job, doesn't have to be. It could be in your personal life here. There's a decision that you got to make here, sweetheart. I'm telling you. Wow, look at this. This lands on the same card again. Somebody that you're dealing with here with this three of cups. This could be somebody in your friend circle here. There's something that you want, you want to go after. Something with strong desire that you have here, possibly even love here. But somebody is, is telling you no or giving you bad advice here. You got a hater. All right. This is crazy. This, this is something that could be very successful here. This person also might be a little bit jealous of you because you might have, you know, some type of notoriety or, you know, <laughs> you may have fans. I don't know. Um, could be, you know, attracting a lot of tension. Very successful here. And someone sees that. And they don't like it. This this could be somebody in your friend circle, somebody you call a friend. This is a low-key hater. Wow. All right. So, ooh, this is crazy. Let's see. If this is somebody that you're in a relationship with, I don't think you need to be with this person exactly. Damn. This could be a family member, too. This could, oh my goodness. Okay, so like trip. There could be someone here that, just hypothetical, you could have someone that you're interested in, but your mother or father is like, no, that's not the person for you, okay? Um, I don't know what it is about this, but I don't think this is what it is. This is somebody that feels that you're in competition. You're competition with them. 
the five of wands. They bring drama here. So you got somebody that's competing with you that you may not even realize that this that they are. This could be Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. doesn't have to be. You have the potential for the Ten of Cups here, and this person is trying to block this. They're jealous. This person feels some type of way about you, too. But they're hiding it. What did I say? Ooh-wee, who you dealing with? This person is hating on you in secret. My God. And in your face. You got an enemy in your camp, sweetheart, and they're hidden. Somebody who says that they mean you good and they don't. It might be this dude here. Let's see. Clarify Dylan's a relationship with this man. Who is this man and what do they want? Libra, you got somebody that's watching you getting ready to move forward here. Um, I kind of think that this person feels like you're getting ready to close them off. Wow. You're moving forward here towards a new connection, a new beginning. And you got someone here that's trying to sabotage this. They want you to hold back from this situation. But why? They don't want you in this connection here. Why? Why does this person not want Libra to connect here? You're on the road to success. You're going to leave this person behind. You're cutting them off. Okay, this the queen of swords landed over here on you on the road to success and temporary situation. Okay, so this person may realize that you are about to be very successful here, either in love, money, whatever. Whatever this is, you're going to cut them off and leave them out in the cold. Okay, so what does this person have to do with your relationship? I don't get it. And whatever this relationship you're trying to, or this situation that you want, it's going to bring stability. It's going to be very good for you. This person does not want you to do that. They feel like you're going to cut them off. This is way out. It's almost like this person wants a relationship with you. Yeah, look at this. This person is wearing a false mask, being sneaky and shady. Doing stuff that's keeping things out of balance, keeping you off balance. If you're trusting this person, you need to stop. You got a new beginning here. And somebody's deliberately trying to sabotage this. You have an opportunity. Oh, my God, this is crazy. Okay, scenario. Oh, snap. This is insane. Okay, trip. There may be someone here that you two know in common, right? This is a damn triangle. All right. You may be interested in this person. They may be interested in this person, but the person is not interested in them. They're interested in you. However, this person over here is low key, high key jealous of the, the connection between you and said person. All right. So this person here, the frenemy is trying to feed you bad cheese about this, this person. OK, bad news giving you illusions, okay, to make you not choose that person, which in actuality, if you chose this this person, this new interest that's coming up for you, it would be your 10 of cups, happiness. You understand? The reason for celebration, the doing the damn thing. And this person here is jealous because they see you're on the road to success. They know that your relationship with them is only temporary because 
What do you two have in common? What's keeping you two together? Oh my God, the common denominator is that person. So this is what you two are linked together by. So what the hell is this? So this person feels like there's no there's no connection here. Or, or if you were to go for that other person, it's going to create some type of argument or drama between you and them. Oh my God, what is this? This is creepy as hell. Okay, this is weird. This is weird. Give me this. So you got somebody that doesn't want you to have this person. All right, they're going to tell you. They are going to there's going to be a discussion here about this situation. Someone here is going to end up spilling the beans how they feel and end up flying solo, guarded, hurt. You may end up having to cut this person off, literally. I think this person's going to create some type of drama in your life. It's only temporary, all right? So, yeah, the illusions are going to be revealed here. You're moving on to something stable here, and this actually landed on a um, temporary situation. If you're having any housing situations or anything like that going on with your home, that is also temporary, too. I think the pathway, the road, whatever the answers that you need are actually going to be revealed to you through source. And things are going to stabilize for you here as well, okay? But this is a trip. You're definitely on the road to success, victory, and some endeavors. You got good luck coming here. Source is telling you to seek out more information, okay? Because, yeah, there's some stuff going on here and strong emotions with this person. All right, increase your efforts if you want to obtain your goals. If there is something that you want here, put in the work for it regardless of what this person is saying, because you got a miserable hater here. What are these strong emotions for? Clarify, please, and thank you. There's a burden here. Yeah, um, I almost, wow. I almost called you another sign. Let's see if somebody feels stuck in this situation. Yeah, stuck with it. Ooh. I see that you're not backing down, though. You're standing your ground here. I think you're going to tell this person how you feel, and you're not going to back down. You're going to reveal some things to this person. I think this person is going to reveal some things to you. You're going to have to make a decision on what it is that you want to do. Yep, this is a toxic-ass situation. It may have been cool when this first started, but you're about to find out some things, and you're going to move on from this. Damn, this is going to be an eye-opening experience. Mm-hmm. Wow. The crazy thing is, is that you may actually end up walking away from whoever this person is and going towards your equal, your match, your divine counterpart, king of queens, um, king of, uh, of wands to the queen of wands here. All right. So definitely walking away from a ugh, from a toxic connection. You're holding back from this situation, too. All right. Why is this? Somebody's in consideration about this connection with the queen of wands to the king of wands. Somebody's about to take action here. Let's see. So enough thinking, ready to take action. Secrets are about to be revealed. All right. Making a head over heart decision to move forward with this person. Mm-hmm. With the Ace of Cups. And you got this hater sitting back watching you. All right. So it looks like some of you guys are putting this, um, putting your, your dreams, goals, desires on the forefront. Regardless of what this person wants you to do, okay? You're doing what you want, what source is calling you to do, okay? So, that is a trip. You got a friend of me here, sweetheart. All right. Kind of makes me wonder, is this person really liking on you instead of this other person? Anywho, let's get into the kipper and we're going to go ahead and get a love message. And I'm going to go ahead and get up out of here. Three messages. One more, please, for Libra. Thank you. All right, you got unexpected income. I like it. Messages. We have journey here. So some of you might be actually moving, uh, relocating uh, out of state, out of town. I don't know. 
Uh, this could also could be just the end of a cycle here, all right? Could be the ending of a cycle with that past person here, expectations. So you might be expecting some type of news change here, all right? Waiting for a date for you to make some of these moves and changes here, okay? What are these messages for Libra? Oh, Libra, somebody wants to come towards you, take action here. All right, this could be um, some information, it could be a court decision or something like that. I don't know, um, but it looks like these are going to be some passionate messages. So, <laughs> so yeah, looks like somebody is saying about you from a different perspective, seeing things from a different perspective. This could be you regarding someone else. All right. Doesn't necessarily have to be that. This could be a legal situation, something that you need to take care of very swiftly. All right. Let's see. Libra, you got somebody here that's kind of stuck on you here, sweetheart. Um... This person wants to um, kind of clear the air with you. This, there may be someone here that was a bit immature and very impulsive here. I hate to tell you, but this person kind of feels like they're in competition. They're in competition with you. But this person wants to befriend you. They want to get back into your circle. But this, this person is uh, low-key kind of jealous of you, to be honest. And I think it's because... You come up as the king of coins here. You might be financially stable and things like that. A lot of good things going on for you. All right, so this person might be low-key, kind of kind of jealous of that. Let's see. And if you are on the outs with this person, this person is going to try to come back towards you, communicate, and try to, um, you know, reestablish some type of connection with the ace of coins here. Ooh, who the hell is this? This is somebody that brings drama and conflict into your life, too. This is somebody here that could be involved with other people. So just keep that in mind here, sweetheart, okay? All right, so let's see. What is this journey here? Number 10, there's an ending. Ooh, good grief. Libra, there's an ending here, sweetheart. You have gotten in your car and moved away. You could be moving away from someone here, period. New area. Um, this could be actually pretty far away. But one of the reasons why you're leaving here is because there was a lot of hurt, a lot of drama. Um, you were dealing with someone here that intentionally did things to cause hurt and pain. And you're blocking this person out. Um, bit sad about this, this situation here. But you're going to where you can have peace and stability, surrounded um, by those that really love and, you know, want to protect you and care for you, okay? Um, there may be some regret here about dealing with someone from your past. Good Lord. All right, so I do see there's an ending here. What did I just say? Absolutely. And what it is is that justice is being served here. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Sweetheart, you realize your worth. And then some of you may be actually leaving this situation going towards an empress or um, an ex-wife or a uh, kid's mom or a kid's father. You understand? You may have children with this person here. I don't know. You may be going back towards someone in your past. Let's see. Oh, yeah. Someone here may actually be going back to someone in their past. Someone here is cutting out other options if there was. There's no juggling here, all right? Um, it looks like you've actually made up your mind. If you were dealing with multiple people, it looks like you're cutting these people out. You know where your heart lies, okay? So kind of looks like you might be going towards whoever this is, all right? Yeah, your empress. There it is. 
And like I said, this could be someone that you have children with, all right? Or someone that you will have children with. This is someone that you want to spend time with, all right? Possibly the rest of your life. You might have been on a break from this person for a while doing the single thing, but realizing that, you know what? There is really nothing out here. All this shit that I thought was fun, all this dating, it's really not. You understand? It's, it's kind of draining. And I realized that the sand in my hourglass is basically being depleted and I'm wasting time here, all right? So let me go and spend some time where time is considered valuable. You understand what I'm considered valuable. And like I said, I think you went deep within, connected with source and, you know, really got some information going on here and figuring out what it is that you need to do. And also source is letting you know that there are some people in your camp that you're dealing with, sweetheart, that you need to kind of block out and stop talking to these folks, make a decision to walk away from that, okay? Because it's not healthy. Leave them out in the cold, sweetheart. All right? I'm just saying. All right. What is this expectation for? You're probably expecting changes. Oh, you expected someone to come through with some offers. All right. So, Libra, you may be walking away from someone here closing the door. You may be expecting for that same person to come towards you. All right. When they see that you have made up your mind to close the situation off. All right, wait, Libra, wait, don't leave me behind, all right? I, I, wait, what you got your, your wind up for? Why are you blocking me, all right? So, yeah, Libra, it looks like you're getting a clue. All right, so you're expecting someone to come in with an offer. You're also expecting someone to be watching you, stalking, lurking, looking. They might be holding back here, but you know that they're possibly in the window looking, trying to keep an eye on you, all right? Possibly on your social media. All right, let's see here. <laughs> Yeah, you're definitely moving forward. This is crazy because some of you might have met your empress actually online, okay? Some of you may have come across, you know, you may have been dating a lot of people or whatever, but you may have actually met someone online or, you know, you're conversing with someone online or whatever from your past. I don't know. But whatever this is, it kind of looks like you're moving forward towards this person. May have taken you a long ass time to decide to go towards them or go back to them. But you're actually doing this here, sweetheart. You're about to offer them a pinnacle. I like this. Or somebody is getting ready to offer you this, all right? And you're being watched here, too. All right, this is really crazy. This is crazy. So you're expecting to hear from someone here, all right? Um, this person, you may feel that is a burden. I don't know. Oh, my goodness. Maybe not. Let's see. I got two different people here, though. You're expecting someone from your past to come in and make an offer here. Okay, I get it. I get it. But it kind of looks like this person is a burden. Yeah, there's regrets invested in this. You got the, the Five of Cups landing over here on the Seven of Pentacles. So there's regret you even spending time with this person. And now you're realizing this. What is this popping out? The tower. So you're bringing down the tower here, okay? And you're expecting to hear from this person, like, take me back. You know, we can have a ten of pentacles together. And you're like, you know what? Truthfully, I don't want this. I'm not happy here. So I get it. All right. Give me more about this unexpected income for Libra. Ooh, Libra. You got the ten of cups here, sweetheart, with the eight of cups. All right, and this lands over here on the three of wands. Wait for it, sweetheart. You might have another offer coming in that is going to bring you exactly what you want here, okay? Good news is coming in for you. So it might be an increase in income, new job, new location. Absolutely, new contract, new commitment coming in for you, all right? Better than what you had, all right? Unexpected. Hold on to your pentacles right about now, all right? That's okay. Might be going through a little bit of money pause right now. It's a transition. It's a change for me. Things are actually going to turn around for you, okay? Just have courage and faith to move forward, even though you don't see everything that's going on. All right? Just keep going. Get out of your head, sweetheart. All right? So this is working everything out for you. Keep your emotions in check. All right? You're manifesting beautiful things in your life, moving into calmer waters here. All right? So no matter what it looks like, Know that you are blessed and highly favored, and it's, it's starting to affect your life. And one of the reasons why people are starting to come against you is because they can see the blessing and the calling on your life as well, okay? Just make sure that you see it, all right, and act accordingly. All right, so we're going to get some love messages here, and I'm going to get out of here. I didn't mean to even be here this long. Let's see. 
Especially because Libra doesn't get a lot of views. So I'm spending a lot of time on this reading for whatever reason. Okay. I guess somebody needs to hear it. So let's see. I don't know why. Do a message just for Libra, please. And thank you. All right. So we got Honeymoon. So some of you, oh yeah, Libra, you might be reconciling with someone here, sweetheart, okay? Uh, really soon. Um, some of you might be going where there's a lot of water here, okay? Or maybe relocating where there's a lot of water. I don't know. But it looks like you and this person may be spending some alone time, sweetheart. All right, so let's see. Give me more. Thank you. You deserve love. All right. Retreat on the bottom of the deck. So there may be something that you are actually walking away from going towards this person, reconciling with someone. But pay attention to the red flags here, okay? All right, express your love. All right, pay attention to the red flags, especially if you've dealt with this person before. Um, what we don't want to do is repeat cycles. So make sure that you keep communication open with this person here, okay? Keep it, keep it 100, okay? At all times. Let's see. I don't want to use these. Hold on. Let's use these. Ain't no telling what we gonna get here. All right, so let's see. Give me messages regarding Libra. So some of you will be uh, reconciling with someone, spending some alone time. And like I said, you know, don't um, put on the rose-colored glasses. Like, oh my God, we're gonna get back together and things are gonna be perfect. There's a reason why that split up in the first place. So you got to make sure that you guys resolve those issues here, okay? And learn how to compromise with each other and, and respect each other's point of view and really put in an effort to try to make this work out, okay? Especially if this is someone that you have children with, okay? Because it it um, not only matters for your relationship, but your relationship with your children too, Okay. If it's not healthy for you two to be together, then don't. All right? So there's that. All right. So what messages do we have for Libra, please? We got in this situation. The moon, Libra, you are in your feelings about this situation. Let's see. You may be watching this person. This person may be watching you. Hold on. Also, someone here might have been single for a while. There could have been some things that you've learned while uh, you are out here doing this single life here. All right, so it's forcing you to make some type of decision here, whether to stay single or get into a relationship. Get married, I'm just saying. <laughs> Let's see. That's funny how that was there. Let's see. You need three more for Libra, please, and thank you about this situation, please. Right. Yeah, Page of Pentacles, kind of considering if you want to give this pinnacle to somebody. All right, really considering this. This is definitely someone that is uh, you would be going back to. All right, the hermit feeling some type of way about this situation. I get it. I get it. This is this is a this is a heavy load here, sweetheart. All right, we got death card here. Let's see, and we have the devil. Oh my goodness, there's some obsession here. What Libra? Okay, you feeling your past person, huh? Let's see. I don't know. <laughs> This could be some toxic ass situation. I don't know. It did say uh, watch for the red flag. So we're getting ready to clarify and see what's going on here. But it does look like there are some lessons learned here, sweetheart. Somebody is keeping an eye on a past person here. All right. But still doing their single thing. All right. But it has this pinnacle that they're considering giving, but in their head, talking to source about this situation. All right, not sure if there's going to be some type of change, transformation with this ending here. And somebody is obsessively thinking about this. Uh, give me any information on the moon. That didn't take long. Okay, yes, yeah, somebody, three of cups, somebody wants to reunite. They want to reconcile with someone from the past. I get it. Have They've been wanting to reconcile with someone from their past for a minute, okay? A long time, but... Something about their behavior, inconsistent, okay? The Knight of Wands, possibly out being a player right about now. You understand? But someone here um, was busy. They had uh, other curricular activities going on here, okay? But now someone is coming to the realization that they're ready to cut this out, all right? 
I want to go home for us. I'm just saying, all right? Somebody is actually watching. Libra, you may be watching someone, your star, all right? Your wish fulfillment. Um, this could be your person, someone that wants to heal a relationship with you, looking at you like you're their wish fulfillment. They want to come towards you, all right? Take that leap of faith, um, trusting that source is going to bring you guys together. This person has been very patient when it comes to coming towards you or you towards them. Whatever it is, this person wants to bring this into common waters. All right, let's see. They want peace in this relationship. This person plans on taking action. All right, even though this person's single, happy, abundant, doing their thing, there's someone that they want here. All right, and they're taking action. They're going after their wish fulfillment. So there's messages coming in here. And I think this has been weighing on this person's heart for a minute. There may have been other people involved here as well that wants this person's pinnacle. So Libra, you might have a lot of suitors that are trying to, you know, hey, tie you down here. I want, I got this pinnacle for you. I, I want you to take it. You understand? So you're weighing your options. Some here look good. Some smell good. Some look and smell good. The sex is bomb. The conversation is good, but that's that mental connection, that spiritual connection is not there. All right. So Libra, you want the whole package. You're looking for someone that compliments every area of your life, you know, as best as they can. And it looks like you may have found this. Okay. Or whoever this is may have found you. So it looks like they're about to cut out the competition here. Okay. The chariot, um, definitely moving away from this competition stuff. Give me one more. Absolutely. Somebody's going back towards someone from their past. All right. And it's crazy because whoever this is, you've been watching them or they've been watching you. This is your wish fulfillment here. All right. I had everything here with this past person. My heart belongs to this past person. Um, yeah. And unfortunately, for some of you, this could be the same person that broke your heart. All right. So you got to be careful with this and figure out what it is. Um, that you're going back to. Are you going back to a healthy relationship? After all, it's telling you to watch the red flags here, okay? So take your time, all right? And clearly communicate with this person what you know what you want and uh, allow this person to communicate as well and see if you guys can compromise, all right? So there's a seven of cups here. The hermit, you might be a little bit confused about which way to go. Should you go towards this person? There may have been some drama that happened between you two before, which caused some type of separation. You want to avoid that as well. You want to bring in balance and peace here. You really want things to work out with this person. I see that you got a lot of love for this person, but you're hesitant because there was some confusion that was going on here. Could have been other people involved here. And this person may know of it or you may know of it. So it might have you hesitate in going towards this person, okay? Either way it goes, looks like you're speaking more with source about this. You're not making a move yet. You're holding back, but you haven't let go of this connection either, okay? No matter who's coming to your life, you've always held on to this connection because there's something there, all right? So I see you talking to source about this situation, trying to get some clarity and holding back right now. All right, and I also see a conversation that's going to happen between you and this person to clear the air. All right, so let's see. The death card, we got the six of wands. So I do see that there's going to be some type of resurrection happening here, all right? Transformation. So Libra, uh, either you may have made a lot of changes in your life after this uh, breakup happened with this person. You may have like did a glow up here to the king of pentacles, all right? Focus on your stability, matured a lot, you know, grew up a lot, experienced some life, had some life experiences outside of this person. You understand? For some of you, this could have been someone that you were with when you were, um, you know, very young, mid, early, uh, early 20s, mid, early, uh, you know, mid to early uh, 20s here. I don't know. But, you know, maybe the separation happened to give you guys a chance to explore life. And experience things and you realize that this is where home is here okay all right um, maybe you two had to kind of separate so you can have this glow up become successful in certain areas of their life and then come back together oh lord this is too damn many this is a lot i'm not taking all of this i'm not taking any of this hold on this is in yeah this is too many hold on Let me clarify that. Two of Swords. Yeah. 
Right about now, it looks like you're trying to make a decision about this, all right? <laughs> yeah, how to, how to get this to change where both of you are happy, all right? Where both of you can compromise and both you're, you're both getting what you need out of this connection. What is this? I didn't see this. All right, so we got the Queen of Wands going after what it is that you want, determined to get what it is that you want. All right, so you're determined to bring in change here. I see there's a lot of passion here. Oh, absolutely. Somebody single, abundant, happy, doing their thing, wanting to give this extra cup. They got the Nine of Cups, they want this 10. All right, so you got a blessing coming for you. A brand new beginning here. So there's some obsession here with an empress, okay? So somebody is determined to get back with an empress. This could definitely be, like I said, your kid's mom or somebody that's a mother figure, somebody that's nurturing, uh, caring, somebody that's, you know, very abundant, uh, doesn't necessarily have to be financially, but could be as well, you know? All right, let's see. Ooh, somebody's obsessing, but waiting for the right moment. In Hangman, trying to think of this in every angle that they could, okay? Um, why am I obsessing over this situation? For whatever reason, I can't let it go. There's something here. There's something here. This person makes me happy. I'm very sexually attracted to this person. The chemistry is off the chain. Why can't I let this go? Why am I obsessing over this situation? Fuck it. I might as well go and get my cup. Because this is, I, I can't get this person off my mind. When it comes back to everything, this is who I want to be with, Okay. I got to bring this into balance here, but how? I got to be patient. Think about this. I'm out in the cold right now or not as close to this person as I would like to be, but I want equal give and take. I want this ace of cups with this person. I got to be strategic on how to get this together. So what do I do? What do I do? You got to start off with communication. It may not be easy, sweetheart, but if you put in the effort, it will work. I do believe so. Absolutely. Ace of Pentacles. I think you have a chance to have something very beautiful here. I think if you and your person basically both put in the effort and learn how to forgive each other and compromise and communicate, I think this will be a great connection here. We saw the Ace of Cups, the Ace of, of Pentacles, and also the Ace of Wands here. All right. And coming in with the truth with the Ace of Swords. All right. So if you take your time. Put in effort here, equal give and take. I think that both of you could actually uh, work very well together. All right. And I think this will be very successful. And I think both of you will be very happy. Okay. So Libra, good luck on this transition, this transformation, this move, this new relationship, whatever it is that you got going on, sweetheart. Um, congratulations. Uh, do it with ease. Pray about it. Meditate about it. Make sure that you stay out of your head, sweetheart, and let Source work this out for you, okay? All right, take care. Bye.